Hey, good afternoon, everybody. Uh, this is Samir Panjani again, broker owner of MyGPSAgent.com. Uh, we're going to go back on a listing that uh, I, I did a YouTube video on last year, last August. Uh, and uh, it was it was a short sale back then that apparently went back to the bank. Uh, excuse me, it actually got bought up and sold to an, to a third-party investor at the, at the auction back in August. But when I look at the history again... It turns out that I guess the property um, got resold at the auction just uh, recently. So it's kind of weird. I don't know what happened, but um, it looks like it got sold th in March, March 3rd, 2011, for 304000 And it was picked up by this investment company here, um, 304. But when I looked at my other YouTube video when I did it back in August, it was sold for 317. So somehow um, the sale in August, I guess you know they went back on that. Maybe something wasn't done correctly, so they had to um, undo the sale and then try to do the short sale again. Um, now a little bit of history of this property. This was a short sale listing. It's on the lake in Green Valley. And I'll go ahead and get some photos from the prior uh, sale of the home that they're trying to sell for. This was the year-long short sale that I did video on YouTube, and I'll put the link up here um, so you guys can view it. But uh, this home is on, you know, on the lake. It was listed for three hundred and ninety-nine thousand as a short sale. It got withdrawn and canceled, of course, on three five eleven. It got sold on three three eleven to this company again for three oh four. Listed again at four nineteen, okay, a hundred plus thousand more than these people paid, and received a cash offer within two days of the market for full price um, so that's kind of like it's it's kind of like wondering you know like what happened on this deal first off you know why did the short sale t take so long and then why was it um, sold at the auction to a third party back in August of 2010? And then that didn't happen. And then they resold, they, I guess they resold the property again in March 2011 for 304. And then a month later, it closes. Not even a month later. A couple weeks. These guys make quite a bit of uh four nineteen nine. I mean you go three oh four four nineteen nine hundred minus three oh four. Hundred and fifteen thousand dollars gross profit from the time they bought it, March third, two thousand eleven, till the time that the property sold. March 21st 2011 and you're talking about this much money right here so the question is who's really who's really making money on these deals the bank lost the short sale at a higher price for 399 they didn't want to take it but then they end up selling it at the auction for 304. So the question is why did why didn't the short sale go through and why did it take so long for the short sale? Like what what how would the investors benefit from taking a lower price in their hands 304 versus the property that was listed for um, 
right here for 399. I mean, you're almost talking like, you know, 100,000 difference. So, I don't know what's going on, but somebody's got to investigate this on why these, these deals are taking forever. Um, so, I'll, I'll go ahead and do another video pretty soon here. We'll look at the other uh, foreclosures for today. But I just wanted to get this video out because I noticed that this property had sold... Um, and it's just really unfortunate how how these people are doing things and how these banks are operating and so-called investors behind these deals are operating. I went ahead and called the um, the listing agent for this property that was here, but uh, I guess they didn't have any information on that because the broker had took over. I guess the listing agent is not no longer in their office. Kind of makes you wonder why as well. What what happened? All right, guys, we'll take care and. Uh, if you have any short sale questions, please give me a call and uh you know I'll be glad to uh to help you guys out or answer any kind of questions um that you have regarding a short sale. Thank you.